What's up guys, Cash Toes Dave here, and today I'm showing off a Cash Toes exclusive eight-piece professional lockout kit. You can order this kit yourself by going to cashtoes.com, or I'll leave a link in the description. Now, every piece of this kit is made by Access Tools. You can go to their website and order each piece individually, but you will be paying a little bit extra. There's not a single piece in this kit that you won't need, and I haven't added any extra pieces or any tools to this kit that you're not gonna need. If you wanna feel confident showing up on scene and having all the right tools, whether you're running towing services or only doing roadside, this kit, in my opinion, is an absolute must. Now, let's get into it. What's in this kit? So first up, we've got the 52 inch Quick Max. Uh, this is probably your most common tool. The Quick Max here is pre-bent at a precise location and it can also be bent and formed in case you have a more difficult angle to reach. It's also coated with a scratch proof protector to prevent any damage. And it also has a rubber tip at the end to grip the handle or the lock switch, whichever one you're going for. It also has a twist off cap in the handle where it stores additional rubber tips. You just unscrew the cap here and you'll have three more tips included. This tool, I don't think it's very debatable that is almost absolutely necessary for any lockout professional. I always get quite a few compliments on this guy. This here is the 36 inch button master. Like the Quick Max, it also has a protective coating to prevent any damage or scratches. Now this, this is also flexible, but you wanna be careful because there's a wire that runs through the middle of here and you don't really wanna bend it too much. Um, my Quick Max, I just have a slight curve at the end and uh, that just gives me the right angle. This tool is specifically used for vertical buttons. Um, if you can see at the end, it's got a wire with a little rubber protective sleeve around it. How this works is you push down on the button and it makes the loop wider. You put the loop around the lock and then pull up on the button to tighten it and then you pull up. And that's how you unlock the vertical locks. I can have a vehicle with a vertical lock opened up using this tool in under a minute for sure, if not 30 seconds. Next up, we have the one-handed jack. This pry style tool is uh, used to create a big enough gap in the door jam in order for you to get one of your airbags in there. It has a rubber pivot, which will give you a little more leverage when you're prying, or you can use the other end, which is like a little shim, and you can just stick that in there and, and bend it out a little bit to create a gap for your airbag. Next up, we have the standard air wedge and the super air wedge. These air wedges are extremely durable. Um, the one I've had, I've had for years, at least five years now, and it's been through 100 degree temperatures and negative 30 degree temperatures, and they've never failed. The only problem I've had with them is when it gets too cold, it takes a little bit longer for the bulb to expand back out so you can press it again. But regardless, it still works. I've never had an issue with it. The bag inside these air wedges is made out of ballistic nylon, not rubber. Additionally, there's a built-in stiffener that will prevent the bag from bending too much when you go to insert it. You use the one-handed jack to create a gap in the door jam, and then slip this in there about halfway. Once you get it in about halfway, then you start pumping it up, and that's what will create the gap uh, within the door jam. For those tighter door jams, you might need to use two bags. Um, typically, you can get away with just using one, but um, like I said, if, it, if it's too tight, you're gonna wanna stick another airbag in there on the other side and uh, inflate that bag as well. I should note that if you do air this up too much, you could bend the door frame a little bit. You're most likely gonna get a phone call from the customer complaining about a whistling noise. The glass man is used for frameless windows. Um, I have been known to use the air wedges, but I, I do get worried about breaking the window or causing more damage. Uh, this is probably your, your most safest route. Um, it does come with two polycarbonate sheets and they surround a dual wedge on each side. You just stick this into the window and then there's a gap on the rear side where you would stick your 52 inch uh, quick max or your 36 inch bud master to get the vehicle unlocked. And it, using this just makes you look a lot more professional as well, I believe. 
Now, if you've ever performed a lockout on a vehicle at night or on a vehicle that has really dark tint, it's pretty difficult to see. Uh, so I have also included the access tool Smart Light. This is the Smart Light 2. This is a glass mounted light and it has three heavy duty suction cups that you just stick on the windshield and then you can turn the light on. The light on here has a 500 lumen LED light. The suction cups are used to stick on the windshield so you can see, or you can stick it to the back window of your vehicle in case of an emergency. This light has five different settings. You have your high white beam, your low white beam, your steady red, a strobing red, and then an emergency red light. This light runs off of three AA batteries, and uh, I did not include those, so you'll have to go out and get your own batteries. But it does come with a little stand where you can just set it up and maybe on the side of the road when, when you're doing a roadside call, you can just set this up and let that flash while you're working. And then last but not least, we have the 60 inch carrying case. Um, The 60 inch carrying case does come with soft padding and it also has a spot where you can put, I usually put my airbags in here and my one handed jack and then on the zipper side I'll put my smart light and glass man. The carrying case is big enough to store all the tools that you need uh, to get the job done. I like this case because it's got a few storage departments and uh, your tools won't be rolling around the truck all the time. And that's it. Everything you need to provide professional lockout services for your towing or roadside assistance business. Again, you can pick this kit up at cashtoes.com. I'll leave a link in the description. Um, if you choose not to go that route, um, you can go to accesstoolsusa.com and order each piece individually. But like I said, you will pay more. You can go on their website and figure out who their dealers are, but this, this kit is exclusive. You can't get this kit anywhere. Um, if you go to the dealers, you'll also have to pick each tool out individually. Well, that's it for this video. Um, I appreciate you guys. I, we've got over 500 followers or subscribers on YouTube now. So I, I really appreciate that. Um, if you're not already a sub subscriber, please like, subscribe, do all that stuff. Uh, it really helps me out and helps the channel. Thank you guys and stay tuned for the next video.